Hi guys, so I am back another video for this month and again we will go back to reviewing a cosmetics. So before we start to this video guys, sa, sa lahat na nanonood ng aking previous video which is the Antlutz brush the, I mean the uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I mean the Antlutz ultimate beginner brushes review and first impression. Sa lahat na nanonood, maraming salamat. I wasn't able to expect that na ganun kalaking hindi naman ganun kalaki pero it is my first time on my youtube channel na makakuha ko ng in just one week na ganun yung aking views which is almost 3,120 siya ngayon guys pero yun anyway thank you thank you thank you thank you so much at um, yung subscribers ko medyo naging kiss din which, which is I am very um, grateful na ganun yung nangyayari anyway salamat kasi na appreciate yung mga ginagawa ko though I am a uh, underrated YouTube vlogger but still uh, you click you, you click the subscribe button okay so for today guys ang ating review ay ang tiyanan ang Maybelline New York Instant Age Remind Eraser Dark Circle Concealer ayun siya guys I am in the shade um, medium or 130 nakuha ko siya ng 50% off sa Lazada Kung doon ka kamalit, it, it costs 499 pesos, pero nakukuha siya ng 249 pesos. So without further ado guys, let's just get started and play my intro. Put it on ice, bitch, Dr. Pepper. Feeling so clean, it don't get no fresher. Chilling in the freezer when I'm under pressure. I put it on ice, bitch, Dr. Pepper. On the packaging guys. Um, ito siya guys, ganito lang, simple Nasa plastic lang siya And Nasa tube Plastic container siya guys uh, 6.0 ml So Let us read the description Of this product So micro corrector applicator Plus dark circles treatment formula Formula with Haloxyl instantly covers and diminishes the look of puffiness Ayang area looks radiant and refreshed So direction for use Turn color of the microcorrector applicator in direction of arrows Until product is visible on sponge This may require a number of turns Adjust accordingly for desired amount of product Using applicator, apply concealer directly to the under eye area Blending in an outward motion to apply more twist color of applicator, one to two clicks at a time for best result. Use sparingly. So um, okay guys. So bago tayo magproceed sa pinaka main review natin, um, gagamit mo na ako ng aking base, which is I have here the Maybelline Gym Satin Skin Foundation and the uh, Instant Age Rewind uh, Foundation. Yung sa so parang ano siya. So parang ito yata yung kapartner niya guys. Ayan kasi para sa like instant age rewind. But unfortunately guys, I have no idea kung meron siya sa atin. But I am pretty sure na hindi to available sa mga counter or sa mga mall. Nag uh, though it is a drugstore pero ang alam ko talaga guys sa hindi siya available. So um, I cannot use this as is because this foundation is 4 or 3 shades darker then on my skin so I'll be mixing it on my uh, Dream Satin Skin Foundation which is I'm in the shade B2 and dito is I'm in the shade 340 10. So now guys, tapos na ako maglagay ng base sa akin face so let us now proceed to this concealer so what? Uh, Nakasealed siya pero di ko alam paano ko siya bumuksan Kailangan natin ng maraming click para makuha natin yung product. mag appear naman daw sa suspension. Ang ayoko lang guys talaga, I mean, I mean, it's not my preference na ganito yung applicator kasi it is very unhygienic. Lalo na hindi naman detachable yung sponge. Hindi mo naman siya talaga totally mauhugasan. So nakakailang click na ako. Okay, wala pa rin ba? Okay, so, lobas na yung product. So, since hindi ko talaga gusto yung applicator kasi parang ang hygienic, kagamit na lang ako ng brush to transfer it and I'm going to apply it on my under eye. So, yeah. Gamit na lang ako ng sponge and I'm going to transfer it. Ah, 
Ang hirap. De, I have no choice. Kailangan talaga direct. Ah. So I'll be doing the triangle method. Tingnan natin kung kaya niya matakpan. Kasya na siya sa dalawang ay Okay. Ha, paano kaya to? Ayaw ko talaga yung sponge. Hindi ko bet. Okay. And then sa part na ito. To use a dump sponge again to blend it out everything. Wow. Wow. Ang ganda niya, friend. Punta niya guys. Totoo nga. So yung dark circles ko nag uh, nawala na guys. At uh, the good thing is hindi siya nag mubuo na parang hindi siya nag settle sa mga parts na lumulukot. Ang may tag yun wrinkles. Hindi naman siya nag guys. And uh, matte siya. Not totally matte. May narado ng cotton lag kit. Siguro din yung matte finish. And then I can say the coverage is medium to high. I mean, I mean medium to full coverage ang kaya nitong concealer na to. So paabutin ko lang yung concealer sa aking eye part. Okay? Okay, the coverage is buildable. Ganun pa din guys, it is easy to work with. Madali lang siyang i-blend. So yeah guys, tatapos ko na lang muna yung makeup ko and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I am done with my makeup right now. It's a simple look. A little, a little bit drunk blush here. Nagkilay lang ako and then counting contour sa aking eyes and face. Then a nude lipstick and that's it for today guys. So I'll be right back. So it is now already um, 11.49 na ng umaga or let's say ng hapon and I'll be right back later for my next update. Guys, so I am back. It is now already um, 2.03 na ng hapon. So, 2 hours yung nakalipas. Noong nilagay ko yung concealer sa aking face. So far, so good right now. The, the oil is minimal. Hindi naman ganun ako kabilis nag-oil sa kanya. Pero siguro hindi ko na mabiprevent nyo sa part ko sa nose. Pero in fairness naman sa noo, tsaka dito wala pa ako nakikita ng oil. And yeah, it is tolerable pa naman guys. Okay pa naman yung tsura na aking face. It looks... It is still looks presentable naman guys. Um, looking at the mirror, uh, I mean looking at the monitor right now or the screen ng aking phone. It looks presentable pa rin naman guys. So yeah, I'll be right back later for an update again. 3.36 na ng hapon or let's say for um, almost 4 hours na yung nakalipas guys. And uh, naglabas na yung oil and I have to blend na. Yung concealer guys, the more na nag oily ka, mas nagmumukha siyang okay. Mas nagmumukha siyang flawless. And aside from that, hindi siya nagta-transfer yung concealer. Yun ang kinaganda naman sa kanya, guys. At saka, ano, walang cakey na naganap dun sa concealer. At saka, nagbago yung pananaw ko sa concealer. Kasi, guys, hindi talaga ako mailig sa concealer before. It seems like it is quite heavy on my face. Though, I can imagine wearing concealer. Pero, kasi, ang ganda niya. Hindi siya ganun ka-heavy sa face. Alam mo yun. Tapos, it can give you the total coverage. I mean, the good coverage sa inyong face. Um, sa presyo niya siguro, medyo namamahalan lang ako ng konti kasi it is 499 pesos. Medyo namamahalan lang sa presyo niya sa ganito kaliit. Kasi, sa presyo 499, para makabili ka na yata ng foundation, 
Kaya isang bote ito, 499. Ang liit lang niya. Concealer pa lang siya, guys. Hindi niya totally naalis yung concealer after ko nag-oil. And guys, I would like to tell you that this, that this will be my last um, update kasi inaantok na ako, guys. I mean, ayoko, ay, may, meron kasi araw na ayoko magsuot ng makeup. Alam niyo yun? Parang, yeah. Gusto ko lang talaga siyang matest ngayon ano ba yung performance niya or paano ba siya mag-perform when you are or when you apply it on your face. If I'm not mistaken, they do have three shades of this. Ang kinuha ko is yung medium na pero two shades lighter siya sa akin as you can see. Siguro pupunta tayo sa mas dark pa. Pero ano kasi ito meron siyang yellow undertone. Yan. And yung dalawang click mo doon sa product may natitira. So kasi na siya sa dalawang uh, eye, sa eye patch mo. So pwede na siya guys. So as you can see guys talagang visible pa sa face cream concealer. Talagang nagstay siya guys. And to be very honest, okay yung oil control itong concealer na to guys. I really highly suggest this found uh, this concealer sa mga oily skin na katulad ko. I mean If you're new to my channel guys, I am an oily skin combination. Pero for the oily skin guys, okay siya guys. Uh, matagal mag-oil up or matagal maghulas ang inyong makeup pag ito gagamitin ninyo. So yeah, that's it for today guys. Thanks for watching. Anyway, don't forget to subscribe on my channel but also to give me a thumbs up. And, all do <laughs> and also don't forget to follow me on my social media account. I'm going to put the link or my information on the description box. And see you on my next video guys. Bye!